Christina, universe, citizen, synergetics, thought, process, presents Planet Utopia, episode 68, 083123. Is it the competitive personalities intensified self-righteousness? Starting anew on Planet Utopia, me and you. Is it the competitive personalities intensified self-righteousness whose seething ire can accelerate toward annihilating the other's existence once and for all? Is it to be rid of the intolerable recurring underestimation of the competitor's cleverly concealed enormous ego, I ask? In view of the recorded religion extremes that in particular declares God in that spoken language, which is not the English language, is the only God and is great as proclaimed from the 7th century, a period in human history from 601 A.D. through 700 A.D. Had there been no murderous slaughtering of anyone who differs in opinion and who follows different tenets and doctrine, there would be no need to be overly concerned about more than one side of any religion. Apparently, this applies to all religions that at the outset did not know, could not have known, all that has since been discovered, especially with respect to systems from the macrocosmic to the microcosmic universe about which all of us still have a whole, W-H-O-L-E, a whole lot to learn by comparison. Universe, eternal, omniscient mind, yom, will ever be the most supreme intelligence that designs every star in galaxies of stars, in the ever-expanding and contracting universe, every planet, moon, and sun, as well as all the interacting forces of nature's intertransforming environment. Calling this supreme intelligence by the sound word yom is not similar enough to the more familiar sound word God that is spoken and written thus in the English language. Most likely, yom will not be nearly as appealing as God and other established sound words for the imagined divinity, primarily because... The sound word God over centuries is a long-established religion association which relates to belief, a faith-based inculcating authority from the printed pages and what the human is designed in principle to accredit its existence throughout a whole lifetime. The words, rites, rituals in printed religion pages provide quotable experiences. This is, as types of lessons and admonitions to inform contemporary and future generations of the previous generation what their experiences of God accounted for, including love, hate, fear, and other emotions. And so the content of religion books can influence, persuade, and in some cases, demand obedience under threat of cruelest harm to the loss of one's life. The content of religion books, therefore, can 
suffice to satisfy whatever the reader, the follower, the indoctrinated human imagination, its intelligence, its mind and brain agree to abide by without further question. Doubt, supposedly, are satisfied. And fortified by the increasing numbers in membership that, as a congregated mass, can overpower anyone's differently directed curiosity and intuitive mind, intuition's metaphysical ability, conceptualizes physical systems and patterns of the system independent of size, time size, time, space, sizing. Most likely, this has always been accomplished by humans who observe the physical environment, which includes human behavior, as perhaps the easiest to control compared to nature's systems, its natural forces, which are not dependent on humans and operate as eternal generalized principles. Religion forces vary by ambitious intention and instinctual survival, where all who fall under its authority also belong to its influential power that intends surviving beyond any human's lifetime. Such survival is recorded in histories of long-lasting religion belief systems manifesting its particular form everywhere in the world. Each of those religion systems has its own established sound word for God as the one and only, and so it is understandable that all those religions could reject the other sound word while joining forces in a type of feigned unity as a politically adaptable survival advantageous necessity. This is occurring wherever such integration is assured by the people's interpretation of laws and political advantage that gain more power by the voting numbers in the religion population. That numbers multiply themselves, though, ought to be consciously considered as living proof of exponential numbering in the name of religion as popularized agendas that eventually advance beyond what anyone would have expected not so long ago. A type of encroachment overshadows common sense in the name of religion beliefs as the Associated Press story by Karen Matthews reports concerning Muslim call to prayer that can now be broadcast publicly in New York City without a permit. Undoubtedly, humans everywhere expect any number of reactions, favorable and unfavorable, but in any case, veers closer to an as yet undisclosed personality of that competitive system which is as likely to some degree in all three major religion traditions, Christianity, Islam, and Judaism, that believe in one God. This is explained in the conversation, the truth about whether Islam is a religion of violence or peace, published October 6, 2014. Link will be included at the end of this video. It is where a type of competition is always underway to eventually invalidate the individual whose intuition alerts its integral intelligence to deeply think about natural interrelating forces, the most generalized metaphysical conceptioning of which would be gravity and radiation, of universes, cosmic to local angle, frequency, crossings, lines, areas, conceptuality, 
of the minimum thinkable set, minimum structural systems, eternal pattern integrity. R. Buckminster Fuller discovered the ability to identify all experience in terms of angle and frequency in addition to the mathematician Leonard Euler's crossings, lines, areas as absolute characteristic of all pattern cognizance. Furthermore, Synergetics 251.06 shows the gravitational radiational constant using the exponential number 2 in superscript frequency times 10 to the second power plus 2. It is of the same mathematical coordinate system that systemic thought's conscious awareness recognizes as the omnirational accommodation that is both the linear and angular acceleration that the ancient scribes of religion books knew nothing of. This is because it was a 20th century discovery by R. Buckminster Fuller. Reading and writing while mindfully observing the reenacting articulations referential to synergetics inspired me to write a more accurate sound word for God, which is Yom. It sounds so unfamiliar compared to what anyone speaking and reading the English language is accustomed to. We are unaccustomed to foreign sound words for God and the rituals of their religion, some of which disguise the enormous ego that resorts to extreme cruelty against non-believers, and yet what appears passively unthreatening as members are called to worship as devoted followers, nevertheless, are not only increasing exponentially across the world, so too is the influence that overrides, overtakes, supplants the individual spoken or unspoken voice to a vote. The individual's inherently inviolate space ought to be respected where silence and absence of unwanted interference cannot be obliterated by political personalities, political pressures brought to bear on any number of vulnerable humans as the religion systems membership grows to dominate the voting privilege technically and literally nullifying its voice, reclassifying the local populations as a religion community. In a relatively short time, religion systems whose God, by any spoken or written sound words, ultimate authority actually can be in a direct opposition to freedom, liberty, and happiness that by design are also for recognizing the inherently inviolable integrity of the individual. The individual's inviolate integrity is a unique design, one of a kind, by the eternal omniscient mind. Whether we agree to call the supreme eternal intelligence yom or simply refer to every degree of freedom to the evolving natural environment self-regenerating system integrity patterning, it can be differentiated from any of the PRJWBCHM politics, religion, justice, war, belief, complexes, hierarchical matrixes, competitive ambition, where life and death become claimed ownership by those authoritative systems. To reiterate, is it? The competitive personalities, intensified self-righteousness, whose seething ire can accelerate toward annihilating the other's existence once and for all? Is it to be rid 
of the intolerable recurring underestimation of the competitors cleverly concealed enormous ego reference synergetics 240.2820 synergetics corollaries synergetics 445.01 synergetics 443 vector equilibrium is equanimity model synergetics 503.03 synergetics 251.06 Muslim call to prayer can now be broadcast publicly in New York City without a permit. Story by Karen Matthews, Associated Press. The conversation, the truth about whether Islam, da, 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 one nation under God. Contact planetutopia60 at gmail.com. Until then, thank you for giving this video presentation some deeper thought.